My people, you don't read who. Make una they look this truck. Now Nigeria be this. This truck, it don't carry overload. So they in leg, no they reach ground. And if na bad driver, imagine, say na bad driver, they ride this truck. In no go ever gets to his destination. Now watch this video to the end. This is BVI and I want you to welcome back again on this platform where we tell you undiluted truth. When I came across the video you watched, the truck that is overloaded, just like Nigeria, is overloaded with insecurity, with poverty, with hunger, and bad governance. Nigeria needs a better driver if there is hope for you if there is hope for any nigerian including those living in diaspora i'm telling you honestly just imagine having the likes of tinibu and atiku driving this overloaded truck you called nigeria you will never get to your destination you will never get good governance. You will never get security. Your youths will never get job. Your pensioners will die without their, their, their pay. And that is why there is a change in the narrative. The Peter Obi that he ticket is that game changer. exaggerate or overemphasize what is already very simple to understand go and pick up your pvc if you want this truck overloaded truck called nigeria to be offloaded so that at least we can get to our destination safely whatever destination you are looking for is it um uh, restructuring nigeria you will get it is it security you will get it. Is it law and order? You will get it. Is it employment? You will get it. Is it turning Nigeria from consumption to production? You will get it. If only this truck is offloaded. And the only way you can do that is to have good drivers and its conductor. 
Now, Peter will be the driver, Dati, now the conductor. Yeah? Make they offload this garbage of impunity in government. And then, this truck called Nigeria. May get to its destination. Oh, yes. Whatever thing you are aspiring for is loaded with this package of change in the revolution we call ballot revolution. I am glad I have been preaching this for more than four years now. And thank God we are right here to witness it. Be part of it. Don't stay on the sideline. Help me share this video so that it will reset the Mumu mentality of some Nigerians that are still clamoring for the old order. I don't blame them. It is poverty and hunger. There is nothing that thing cannot do to a man. But we are determined and committed on this task. Bye-bye for now.